I'm just getting over my nerves. How? Nerves of what? Oh yeah, Nick's just screamed the place down. No time for this, come on. Come on, power walking back because the tide is coming in fast. So we're having to go up the cliffs. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hello guys, welcome to a new vlog. It's Sunday for us. No, it's not. It's Monday for us. It's a bank holiday Monday. Um, it's 12 o'clock, almost afternoon, and we are going to go out once Nick's ready for a long, long walk in preparation of Snowden. Are you ready? Yeah. So, I will try my um, water food song when I get back and I'll show you guys. But I'm going to go out today as if I'm going up, up Snowden. So, you know, you're going on yeah, but I've got my bag packed with all the stuff that I will be taking to Snowden because I want to see the um, weight of it. So, I've got the waterproofs in there. Um, I've got my camera bag, which I will be taking as well with me. And I've got this little Converse bag, which will go around the front for things what I need to just get easy access to. No, I've not got your phone. Like um, an umbrella, just in case it wazzes it down. Um, some antibacterial wipes, uh, etc., And a hat. So, um, what I've Tush said I'm going out with all the things I'm planning to take up Snowden. There's some snacks in there, there's food in there, there's a bottle of drink in there. Um, so give it half an hour and I'll be carrying it. It's a test. Well you'll have your own bag in Snowden, so no, but I'm not carrying that. It's a test to see what it's gonna be like walking up Snowden. I'm just getting over my nerves. Ha nerves of what? Oh yeah, Nick's just screamed the place down. You want to explain why? Because we've got still getting wasps in. Dead wasps, though, that are appearing every single time we open the boiler cupboard, which is exactly parallel to where the nest is. I've got spider in shoe. And um, just cleared them all out and sealed it all with um, wire wool. Lifted up the um, bath mat, and a spider the size of that jumped out and started running. And he screamed like a girl. And and like, 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 Ooh! It was like that. Let me start your rooster out. Go on then. So, how many miles are we walking today? Eight. Are we? Ooh, that's not far off Snowden, but obviously Snowden's on a, an incline. Well, this is on an incline because it's a beach. Uh, so we're walking on the beach. We I'm may... not putting my thousand mile socks on because they're in the wash. Oh, so oh really? I to wear my Everlast socks. Ooh, well, I've got my thousand mile socks on. Um, and we may stop for a coffee along the way at some point. Although that won't be available on Snowden, I don't think. Well, it will be in your little flask. Well, yeah. So uh, come on, let's get a move on. Come on then. Right, we're on the beach. We've got about six or seven miles left to go, haven't we? And the rest. And then we're going to... We're already knackered. <laughs> we're not. The sun's just starting to come out. Then we're going to do it all in, re in reverse then. Oh, is that eight miles in total? It's four miles there, four miles back. Right, okay. That's not too well, bad. Well, a little bit more than that, actually, because that's just the perimeter edge of the village. Nick's just come up with a plan for when we get there. Said we might share a fish butty. Yeah, 300 calories for a fish. For a fish. 200 calories for a tea cake, divided by two. 250 calories. We need to be back for tonight's Fat Fighters as well, which Nick is hosting. I'm not hosting. You are hosting. I am not. Nick, Nick to do it. I've put on. <laughs> be a bit hypocritical Shame if I yourself. did it. Shame yourself. Is it time for a snack yet? Yeah. Hot drink? No. I was only joking. We've only been going five minutes. Snaps. Let's get some snaps out. Bugger that. We've only been going five minutes. Five minutes? We've been walking 15, 20 minutes. Oil tanker out there. Waiting to drop its oil off. That one looks like a battleship out there. You want drink? Uh, no, thank you. So, I hope it's this mild when we're doing snow, and it's perfect, and actually. The long-term forecast is not looking good. Right. It's got a bit more pebbly now and stony. And uh, tide seems to be coming in a bit, but we have checked the tide times. We're going to be fine. And um, my feet are nice and dry, thanks to these shoes. How are you doing? Hungry. Hungry? Well, when it's Snowden Day, you'll have to make sure you, you pack a lot of food. I'm packing nuts, nut bars, uh, energy bars, bananas. chocolate. No, you can have banana. Snack time. We're about halfway. 501, 90 calories, triple chop cake bar. That's going to put me on until we get this fish butty. I presume I've got some money. Well, I hope so. Ew. Jellyfish. I think so. It's a bit discolored though. Is it dead? No, it's alive. It's dancing around on ice. Well, I don't know. I've never seen a jellyfish in real life. 
I've only seen him. bloody dead, it's not moving. I've only seen it in Nemo before. Well, you don't see them in Nemo, it's a dirty North Sea one. Mm, right, come on. Oh, thank God. Thank I'm gonna, God. I'm gonna inhale this. We've just queued for an hour for this. <laughs> Let me know how it tastes. <laughs> I want my bit. I want my bit. Oh my God, that nice. was amazing. Mm. No time for this, come on. Come on. Power walking back because the tide is coming in fast. Cliff there. Cliff's just there. Water just about Water's 10 feet there. to the right. And we've got at least another hour to go until we get back. We may be climbing up the cliffs yet. When I get back, I'm going to have one of those. I didn't show it yesterday, but we've got. Ooh, I know what you're going to say. Kit Kat, salted caramel Kit Kat. That's not what you were going to say. What do you think I was going to say? Five or one rainbow birthday cake thing. Well, you power them. I'll have a Kit Kat salted caramel. Let's run. Right, we've just met our friends, Peter and Elaine, coming back in the other direction, saying that it's too late, the tide is too much in. They were just randomly walking back as well, and they got stuck. So we're having to go up the cliffs, and hopefully none of it collapses. Let's hope none of it erodes while we're going up. Time ahead, it's lapping the cliff button. We've got to get up there somehow. Oh, there's some steps there. We'd we'll have carried on, wouldn't we'll we? On, <sighs> At least this is a bit more training for Snowden and a good test of his shoes, which I think are thoroughly worn in now. <laughs> oh my goodness! Elaine's okay. She was laughing on the floor. She just missed her foot in. <sighs> now we've got to get up there. Off, right, there we go. We're up. Are you fine, Elaine? Oh, I'm not <laughs> <laughs> An hour later, my we're feet. still not back. My feet hurt. Why? My legs are killing me. My feet, my hips, my ankles, my toes. But they're not rubbing. No, my feet, my shoes are fine. They're just aching because we've done so much. Oh. We've actually walked longer than we will be doing at Snowden. But no hills. But no beach, hills. But beach walking. So I'm glad we've done it. However, but I can't when we got back, back well, because we had to climb the cliff, we went back to the, the, the edge when we got back to closer to where we, where we got on, and the, the cliff was lapping the bottom. So if the, we hadn't have gone up, uh, yeah, the sea was lapping the bottom, so if we hadn't have gone up that cliff when we did, we would have been stuck and they'd have been calling Coast Guard. I just cannot wait to sit down. Another mile to lodge. And have a drink or something. Shoo. Shall we get the chairs out the back and have a nice orange gin? Oh, I could do. How's it feeling? Now you've got your shoes off. Hot and possibly oh, blistery. Oh. Blistery? Oh no, I don't think I've got make blisters. It feel like but just... I'll tell you something, these thousand mile socks make your feet so warm. I feel like I've done a thousand miles. Oh. I need to sit down. 11 miles, I've just worked it out. That's two miles more than Snowden, so this is probably what it's going to feel like with an incline. Oh. Cup of tea. Oh. Tea time. Oh. Oh, I just can't get me eyes on Ten miles, guys. Ten miles. Oh, eleven miles even. Did I say I thought it were eleven? It was eleven. It were eleven. That last one, I were a bit delirious for it. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just empty, Wesher. And I'm fucking sea. So, my legs are aching. I've had a snooze. But I'm quite proud of us eleven mile walk. Yeah, I kind of wish we hadn't started it, to be honest. You wish we'd not started it? Yeah. What, what do you mean? Well, I just, it got what nice. Don't be such a baby. I'm glad that we've done 11 miles. Makes me feel better about Snowden. Even though I don't think it's going to be that hard anyway. It's just going uphill, that's all. Rather than on a flat. So it's going to be harder. Well, obviously it's going to be harder, but... We were trying to run a little bit. Well, we didn't show you on the blog, but we were running. Um, because the tide was coming in. And when you, Peter and Elaine were in front of us, so we thought, oh, let's try and catch them up. And then they just appeared in front of us, coming opposite way, and we were like, what are you doing? And they were like, you can't get past, the tide's coming. It was lapping the bottom of the cliffs. So we walked up that ravine, well, cliff, we whatever, um, as you saw, and Elaine went flat on her ass. But she didn't hurt herself and we helped her up and she was laughing all the time. She had a funny turn. She just couldn't get up. <laughs> she had her legs in air, going up close. But we had to do that. Oh, there's your socks. They're in wash. The 1,000 mile socks. Good. Um, but it was good. So 
Will it, will it burn off a lot of calories? 1,100. Calories? Yeah. And we have... Oh! Your telephone! There is some in the room. Oh, it's not. Was it? I don't know. Ooh, best answer it. I'm answering it. Oh, not again. I'm not answering it. Let's go you. No. Not answering it. Unknown number? Yeah. Well, well it were a number, but I, I, didn't know, I didn't know what it was. Let's just hope it wasn't an update on the thing. Not on a bank holiday Monday. You never know. That was our walk today. My legs are really aching, actually. <sighs> See, I don't think snow's going to be quite as bad because we won't be running or we won't be trying to, to fight off the tide, you know what I mean? We've got some people coming with us. Not in our group. We're doing multiple sort of like small groups, so comply with social distancing and we don't want to get, get near people. We've got some people that aren't very used to walking, so we think we're going to advise people to maybe like stop every, stop every 30 to 45 minutes, have a drink, have a rest. So we'll, be minutes, we'll be doing that, never mind everybody else. It'll be fine, it'll be fine. The day before we do that, we're doing the um, zip wire. That's not for charity, that's just something that we've always tried before doing. Um, some of our neighbours did it a long time ago, and we, when we saw their video, we always fancied doing it. Um, so that should be fun. And Yaz and Ash um, are going to do that also on the same day. I'm not sure whether they'll be doing it at the same time. I think there's four people do it at the same time. Nicky could be doing it. Um, Nicky might be doing it. Depends on his arm, he's got his pot on it at the minute. Yeah, he's got so. his pot on his practice wrist. I don't think Charlotte's doing that. Yeah, we get to see Charlotte again, which we haven't seen for... We've not seen since well, since, well, yeah. since she left. We're not since Charlotte or Nikki since January all because of these lockdowns, so I'm looking forward to seeing them. And some of the people that are going in some of the groups are camping. Um, so I'm not sure when we'll enjoy that. If we'll see them, but um, we considered that for about five minutes. Didn't no, we, we didn't. <laughs> we didn't consider that once. For about five seconds, maybe. We've done our camping days many years ago. We once bought a 10 man tent, sold it two days later. We slept in it first. We slept in it. One night. We woke up and our um, airbed had gone flat, so we were, we were uh, sleeping on the floor. And um, we vowed to never do it again. We vowed never to do it again, and we sold everything. So, yes, our camping days are over. I don't like communal showers or communal poos. Right. Let me know when tea's ready. Right. Ooh. Five seconds. <laughs> tea time. And we are having. Garam masala, crispy chicken, and Bombay potatoes. I've got to use more garam masala because they're not enough. This looks like one of the nicest buns we've ever had delivered. If it look, ends up looking like that, I think. What? It looks beautiful. Yeah, it never looks like that though. Well, get yourself sorted out then. Um, I think I'm going to have a um, spring water and um, I think I will something or other. Yeah, me too. I feel a bit dehydrated. So we've got, uh, what time is it now? Five minutes, well, ten minutes until it's our Fat Fighters meeting. Fatty Fighters. Well, I've put four pounds on, so I, I shall even be attending. Nikki's uh, hosting it this week. Um, I've put three pounds on, but I think as the week goes on, it'll drop off. Um, and obviously we're doing really well today on our walk. So, um, what's happening? What's happening here? I'm absolutely knackered. Well, me too, but... Um, right. Well, Chicken's cooking, potatoes cooking. Um, spring water. Yeah. Have you had one of my caramel salsa Kit Kats? They're not yours. Have you had one? Yeah. Ask permission next time. What was it? What did you think to it? Absolutely delicious. And I'll be having more. I'll show you what they look like. They actually come in a box, but they're like Kit Kat sensors. Salted caramel. Not as nice as the mint ones, I don't think. Oh, it's ten times better than the mint. Ten times better. This looks very succulent chicken. It is very succulent. So, what else is to go with this? Let's have a look. So we have some green beans. And what we else do? Garlic, there? Garlicky green beans and Bombay potatoes. Oh, oh right, okay. I hadn't seen this. The Bombay potatoes. Let's have a look at these. Delicious tasting Bombay potatoes. I knew this one was going to be nice. And mint and yogurt sauce. Oh, yeah. So, look at that. And you just made that end. up. Right, so I'm going to. I do love Hello Fresh. What's in there then? What's this brown stuff? Uh, garlic. Mm. Roasted garlic. Oh, that mint smells so fresh. We've just had a Fat Fighters meeting. Lots of people lost weight. Lots of people put on those well. Yeah, me too. But um, you're allowed to wobble. Wobble? As long as, like you don't, weeble. as long as you don't start to wobble too much. Right, let's go and eat this and then I'm definitely going to try 
my uh, waterproofs on. Can I just say that that was the worst HelloFresh that I've ever had? The chicken was delicious, it was really succulent, but everything else, the yogurt was runny, it didn't really have much flavour, the mint wasn't very minty. I'm finally trying these on. So I'm speaking! If they're any good. Hello Fresh, Hello Fresh, don't be rude. If they're any good. Don't be rude, interrupting, I'm speaking. Hello Fresh, we haven't put them on. No, if they're any good. We only put things in our store for a little bit, things are good, yeah. people might like. Yeah, if we don't like it, we send it back. So I've got medium. So Lee basically has got these for putting on when we go to Snowden. Please don't pull your trousers down. No, nah, you, yeah, your belly stuck out there. Just well, I can see it and no. all. You can tell you've stuck on some pounds today. So, what the hell? You got rubber pants? Waterproof. These are medium. So I'm hoping they're going to be fine. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Well, aren't you look at Jeff and Charlie walking up a hill? Uh, I'll be driving. How much were they? There. I think they were about 12 quid. For both? Um, no, 12. I think these were about 8 quid. And the jacket was about 12 quid. So about 20 quid for bottoms and top. I've seen people up there with woolly hats on and being absolutely wet through. Yeah, well, you're looking, you're looking at videos from winter rather than now. Oh, last week. And then this is the um, coat. It's very S&M. It, it did come in um, blue as well. Maybe that would look better. Well, yeah. Oh, that looks a bit tight on you. I don't think so. It looks a bit tight under arms. Well, it's not. So this just goes over your clothes. Yeah. Uh, maybe. Has it be all snug? Mm. I'm going to face mask as well because there's lots of people apparently. Order me two. Order me one with it in blue. Same sizes as you. We'll put these on our Amazon storefront um, in case anybody else is interested. What kind of material is it? Is it like one use material, like a poncho? Oh no, it's like tent material. Right, order me. Order me some. Right, I've ordered my navy ones. They should be here either tomorrow when the rest of our stuff arrives at the Amazon locker. And um, can I just point out? Um, to Russell Platt that the uh, bulb is still missing from the extractor. Get it sorted. I actually took all the bulbs to the apartment, mm. thinking that we might need them there for the mirror. Well, hopefully we might go to the apartment this week, I don't know. What? We might go to the apartment this week. What for? Well, if we get to know more about the thing, it's over that way, and it's over. Makes I don't think I don't think all's going to happen in the next two weeks. Oh well. Well, we'll definitely be going over there when we go to Snowden because it's closer to Snowden. Yeah, I think we'll probably end up going back like the, the couple of days beforehand. So. I'm just playing on Switch. And, um, yeah, if anybody was wondering how come Peter and Elaine suddenly appeared in our vlog today, we went for a walk on his own. They saw, they were in a cafe in town, they saw us and sent us a message, and then um, they set off before us while we were eating our fish butty, and then. I, because I noticed that the tide was coming in, I messaged him on, on WhatsApp and I said, thinking they were still in the cafe, hurry up, the tide's coming in, you're not going to make it back if you don't set off now. Little did we know that they were actually in front of us um, and then we could see people in the distance and we could see that the, 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 the water was getting closer to the cliffs, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. And then all of a sudden, they just came out of nowhere, they'd come back. And they were saying, go back, go back. You and they were, they, were, they were in a bit of a panic, actually. And then when we climbed up the cliff, Elaine fell backwards, which, to be, to be fair, was funny. But it was only funny because she was laughing her head off when she was on the floor. She was laughing, but then when she got to the top, I think it was the shock of it, she had a bit of a funny turn, didn't she? Well, so she we just had... sat down for a bit and we all yeah. just caught our breath from getting up the... Yeah, it was the... rather exciting. Um, it's not the kind of thing you have to do. We've never done that before. Getting so caught last, on the beach. Last week she, she uh, almost got chased by a bull in the vlog. Yeah. And this week she fell She got bit by a wasp under her arm. But and not this in the week, vlog, Not in the vlog. And this week she had to climb a cliff. I have to say though, that that, chip, that fish butty was the nicest fish butty that I've ever had. It was beautiful, wasn't it? Oh my God, it was delicious. We did queue for an hour because the woman in front of us um, was basically in the shop. I think she was drunk actually. She was in the shop and she kept ordering loads and loads of stuff and then changing her mind. And um, she was leaning over the counter and the... She didn't the, have a mask. She didn't have a mask. The woman in the, in the fish shop was basically saying, can you stand back please, you're not wearing a mask. Mm. I remember a time during early lockdown when uh, who and a couple of particular people said that we didn't, we shouldn't be wearing masks. And I actually predicted, didn't I, that at some point we will all be wearing masks as part of getting back to normal. You did. So um, I won't say I told you so, but I did. Um, right, what we're we doing now? I'm playing on the Switch, 
You do what you like. And there you go. I feel a bit stuffed after that horrible that tea. Yogurt though, probably. Possibly. Which was nice, with a bit of biscuit. Oh, it was. At least get a plate, he's gonna forget. I've told you to get one. We're only having two each. We're dieting. This is about 500 calories just alone. We've burnt off 1,100 today. This is true and that's why we're having it. I'm just making a nice cup of tea, having some crackers with um, chutney. I'm just gonna relax out when half at night. Let his legs relax. They've actually recovered now. It were the pads of my feet that were just crushed from Mine are... the, the heavy weight that I've had to carry around. Mine are aching as I walk around. Mine are, not now. Hmm. Mine are, in fact, mine are almost completely back to normal. Nick! What? Come here. I'm watching the Umbrella Academy. It's so Umbrella. weird. Umbrella Academy. Umbrella it's Umbrella so Academy. weird, but I really enjoy it. I think even Nick likes it, really. There's a couple of cuties in it, which is why I keep watching. So, you've got some update to do on our um, Two people. geocache, haven't you? Two people on the comments of tonight's video have asked for an update on the geocache. So it's currently travelling and in a German, uh, it's in Germany, it's travelled 1,178 miles. It's on a German army base at the moment. Um, uh, that's as much as I know. So, so it's so making its way around the world. It's gone all around the northern side of England and then it basically went um, over to Germany and then it's travelled around Germany for the last couple of weeks. Mm. So I think it's going to go east eastwards to America actually. Which might be good, but at least it's, it's left the UK now. Good. So, Well, thanks for watching today, guys. If you're not already a subscriber, <coughs> click that subscribe button. Hit the <coughs> notification bell, um, drop us a comment below. And uh, we uh, shall read your comments. And I'm tired. Tomorrow is not a bank holiday, so I can get my blood results by calling the doctors. And I can sort the thing out, or try and get some update on the thing. Fingers crossed. Hopefully. See you tomorrow. Bye.